ManyChat just dropped new AI features and now you can train an AI on your content and automatically reply to comments and DMs. So in this video, I will show you how it works, what's possible and how to set it up in your own ManyChat account. Let's dive in. So here I'm in ManyChat and then here we got a new thing which is called ManyChat AI. And then here it shows that you have AI replies, AI comments and AI goals. And it's good to know that this new AI feature is currently still in beta. So this is like not the final version but they are still optimizing and improving it. And right now it's only available for Instagram but they say that they will add more channels soon. So if you want to get started with this, you can just click here on get the ManyChat AI add-on and it costs $29 per month. And I think this is pretty cheap because you get unlimited AI. So especially if you have a ManyChat account that is doing a lot of messages and a lot of comments, this is really cheap. So what you can do here is just click on upgrade now and now you have access to the AI feature. So then it basically asks you to pick your first move, which is either AI replies or AI comments. So right now we can start with AI replies and then you can click on let's set it up. And then it basically explains to you how it works. So you first need to teach the AI what to say, and then you can set up the AI replies and tell the AI the goals that you actually want to achieve with this. So now I will just click on teach the AI what to say. And then here you can either add a link going to your website, sharing knowledge or add a file, which is like coming soon. So if you just want to add a link, you can just click here, type in the link and then also give a little bit of context. So here you can, for example, say, what's this about? Could be your pricing page. It could be your homepage. So in my case, this is my homepage. And then I can click on submit. And then now it is training basically on that. So you can either review this. So if you review it, you can basically add a new link and then add more. Um, or you can click here on adding details. So that is basically adding the knowledge, right? So we can also do that. So if you click here, you can basically explain what is this about. So I would say these are, for example, uh, information about returns, warranty and delivery. And here on my second screen, I will just drag it in here. I basically just have a document with explanations about uh, warranty and delivery and return information for an e-commerce business. So I can just copy this and then paste that over here and then click on submit. And then the AI will train itself on that as well. And then in the future, you can also upload files. That's not currently not possible, but it will be in the future. So that's basically it. So if you go back to the overview, you can see that you've kind of done step one, which is like teaching the AI what to say. So you give it just the knowledge, which is either website links or like general information. And then here you can set up the AI replies. And AI replies are like replies in the Instagram DMs. So here you can just click on enable. And then these are enabled. So like when you click on it, you can basically test this out. So here you can, for example, say, okay, what is your return policy? And then it says you can return your items within 14 days after delivery, which is exactly in the file. And then for example, if I say, okay, and what is your delivery time? Then it says, if you create an order before three, it will be shipped from the warehouse within two business days. So that's working as well. And it also only replies if it can find knowledge. So for example, if I say, who is Elon Musk, which is like definitely not something that is inside like the document, then it will say, well, we don't have any relevant info for this. And then you can actually do an action, which is this case is only assigning it to a person. So when you click on this, you can just assign this to a team member or a group of team members. So then I can just assign it to myself. So what it will basically do is it will try to answer a question. And if it cannot answer the question, it will just assign the conversation to me. So that's basically how that's done and how you can set up these AI replies. Then the next step that you also can do is set up AI comments. So when you click on this, you can automatically reply to comments. And right now it's only possible to automatically reply to positive comments or nice comments. And it says over here that they will also add more in 10 times soon. So maybe in the future, we can also reply to general comments or comments with questions or like negative comments in a certain way. So you can just enable this. And then what 
ManyChat AI will do, and I think this is this is very interesting, is that it will automatically pick up the tone from my existing Instagram comments and then create replies for that. So here you can just click on review examples, and then it's automatically grabbing some um, comments from my Instagram account. So for example, here, someone commented, truly amazing, such a cool classic style. And then we can reply with, thank you so much. I'm really happy with how it turned out. What do you think I should build next? So if I think this looks good, then I can just click on looks good. And then it gives another example, right? And then it can say looks good as well. So you need to, it gives like five replies. And then if it is not my style, you can basically say it's not my style and then basically describe what's not good about it. So here I can, for example, say, this is not good. It is too enthusiastic and I would never use love emojis. And then hit submit and then ManyChat will automatically learn from that as well. So that's what we can put over here. And then once you have kind of give the information on how you want to reply, then you can just click on turn on an AI comments. And then when someone leaves a nice comment right now, we automatically reply to that. So those are the AI replies and the AI comments. And this basically comes down to when someone sends you a DM and it can find an answer in the knowledge that you've given it, then it gives you an automatic reply. And if someone is posting a nice comment on your Instagram account, then you can automatically reply to that comment also with this AI. And that's actually step one, the AI replies and the AI comments but many chat added another thing which are ai goals so they basically say for example if you have answered a certain question then we can lead them towards a certain goal and at this point they have added three goals they have added share a link grow your followers or capture leads and you can use one of them you can also use all of them so i'll just show you how you can do that so if you click here on share a link then ManyChat asks you to set it up in three simple steps. So after an AI reply or an AI comment, you will get an automatic DM with that link. So you can basically say, okay, what are you promoting? For example, I'm promoting my free ManyChat school community. So if you uh, don't know that yet, if you go to chatomize.com slash school, then here you will find my free school community where I teach you how you can make more money with ManyChat. So I want to promote that. So I just go to chatomize.com slash school. And this is a free community on making more money with ManyChat, right? And then you can click on generate the message and then it will create the message for me. So if it says, want to boost your income with ManyChat, join a free community and unlock the secrets. And then if they go to join now, that's when, when they click on that, they will basically go to my link. So let's say this is set up all right, then I can just click on next, and then this is live. So I can just click on go live, and now after an AI reply or an AI comment, I share a link to my school community, right? So that's the first thing. Then the second goal that we can set up is grow followers. So with grow followers, you can basically say, hey, glad to have you here. Follow along if you are curious, right? So you can hit that, click on next, and then this can go live. Of course, you can customize this message a bit, but in this video, I will just show you how all of these AI features work. And then lastly, we also have the uh, capture leads goal. So here you can tell the AI how you want to capture the lead, right? So what you, for example, could do is after you gave a reply to someone, you can basically say, hey, I also got a free ebook for you. Do you want to get it as well? And if they say yes, then you say, okay, what is your email? And then you can deliver it to them. So what you can do here is you can select the info that you want to ask. So in this case, we are going to ask for our email. And then you need to explain how you will use this info and why it matters to your customer, right? So we can say here, we help the customer by giving a free ebook to deliver the ebook to their email, we need their email. You can say something like, on what email do you want to get my free ebook? Just type it in below. And then I can also add here an emoji. And that's about it. So that's how we do it. And then if the person doesn't want to share their email, we can just assign it to a person, which in this case is me. So that's how it's set it up. They click on next and then you can decide what happens next. So if they give their email, uh, you can like send them a message. So it could be a very simple message with, okay, thank you. Um, here, uh, just click the link below to get the ebook. 
And then here you can just add a link and then add a button label. So it's here, get free ebook. And that basically goes to the link. So in my case, we'll go to my website where I have stored my ebook. So that's how you can basically set it up. You can also trigger a ManyChat automation. So if you already have a automation in ManyChat that you want to use this for, you can just click here and then uh, AI will trigger a specific automation that you can choose from. And then lastly, you can also just assign this to a person, right? So they give it and then you can do that. For right now, I would just go with sending a message. Oh, I just deleted it. So just click the button below for the ebook. And now I'll just add the link, get ebook. And then do that again, save. And that's basically click on next. And now uh, that will work as well. So here we can just click on save. So here we can just put it on, on go live or you can try to preview it yourself. And that actually says, hey, I would love to send you my free ebook. What email would you like me to use it to send it your way? Just type it in below. So you can also like preview all of these AI messages that ManyChat will be sending for you. So if you think this is great, you can just click on go live. And that's basically how that works. And what's good to know that with these AI goals, you can also change the order, right? So if you think growing followers is the most important thing, you can just drag that over here. If you think capturing lead is more important than sharing link, you can just do that over here. And you can also have multiple ways. So you can also have like multiple sharing and links, multiple capturing leads. It could be that you have a free ebook. It could be that you have a free community as well. So you can just have a lot of these things that like, are done in a specific order. And then you can also see if this is live, how many times it was attempted and how many times it was actually successful. And that's how you can set up these AI features. So it basically works in three simple steps. First, you add the knowledge, then you can set up the AI replies and the AI comments, and then you can set up an AI goal so that you can lead them towards whatever goal you're currently having with ManyChat. And I think these AI features are very great. Like we have been waiting for them for a very long time, but now it's possible to train an AI inside ManyChat and automatically reply to DMs and comments without needing like third party tools. That being said, there are also currently still a few drawbacks with this new AI features. And that's what I will talk about right now. So the first drawback is that we currently cannot connect the AI replies to automations. So especially if you're already using ManyChat for a longer time and you have automations for a lot of stuff, then we cannot connect the AI replies to the automations, which is kind of a drawback at this point. So with the AI replies, the only thing that we can do is when the AI cannot find the knowledge to reply, we can assign it to a person. But it would be nice if we could just start an automation. For example, it could be that you automatically want to add this to a different application or that you want to trigger an integration or anything like that. And that's currently not possible. We can only assign it to a person. And that's also the same thing for if someone is basically asking to talk to a human, that's also not something that we can do with an automation yet. So it would be nice in the future if we can also connect these AI replies to many chat automations. Then the second thing is that we cannot give a specific prompt for AI comments. So if you go to the AI comments and go here, basically many chat uh, gives you a few examples that you can choose from, but you cannot say, hey, I want to uh, reply in a certain way. For example, if someone is sending an emoji, I just want to send back an emoji. If someone is asking a question, I want to answer that question. If someone says something positive, I want to send something positive back. That's currently not possible to give like these kinds of prompts. Currently at the moment, it's just only possible to say, this looks good or this is not my style. And it would be nice if we could have more control over these AI comments, because I know that for a few clients of mine, they need to manually reply to just a lot of comments. And if we could just have a prompt that could basically determine how we can reply to these comments, that would be like a huge game changer. But right now that's currently not possible. And I know that like this AI, how they would reply, can be just a little bit too tricky. So I think for most of my clients, I want to have more control over it. And then the last drawback is that we cannot connect our AI goals to our automations. So with these AI goals, I think these are great, but it would be nice if we can just add a new goal and then connect it to an existing automations. Because how I normally use ManyChat is that I have AI automatically answer questions, but the moment I want to convert a follower into a lead or a lead into a customer, that's when I use my own ManyChat automations and my own ManyChat funnels. The problem is at this point, we cannot do that. So it would be 
nice if they would add that in the future as well. So the AI can automatically answer questions and then we can take over with our ManyChat automations and actually convert, for example, a follower into a lead and a lead into a customer. But that being said, I think these AI features are really great. And I highly recommend just enabling this on your ManyChat account and just testing it out. Just test out whether this works for you and for your own business and automatically reply to DMs and comments. And if you want to see how I'm using ManyChat and AI for my own clients, please check out this video.